Hello friends, did you know Indonesia is considering building a massive seawall along the northern coast of Java to save the island, particularly its largest city, Jakarta, from sinking and eventually being submerged, two ministers said Wednesday. But critics warned that the U.S. billion project would only aggravate the ecological and social crisis in the region, and urged the government to adopt a more environmentally friendly and socially just approach to the water-related problems. Parts of Jakarta sink up to 25 centimeters annually because of excessive groundwater extraction and urban development. If it comes to fruition, the project would include the building of a 120 kilometers coastal and river dike by 2030 and an adaptive seawall to the west and east of Jakarta by 2040 before closing the seawall with a reservoir. By 2050, the Jakarta City Administration's target is to finish the first phase of a program to build coastal embankments under the National Capital Integrated Coastal Development Project by 2027. So far, 13 kilometers of the planned 46 kilometers of the embankment have been constructed. Erlanga estimated that the region loses $135 million per year, which could rise to $642.7 million per year in the next decade if no measures were taken and the flooding worsens. Java is Indonesia's most populous and economically important island. Land subsidence, or sinking, is a serious problem in Java's coastal areas, especially Jakarta and Semarang in central Java province, making them more vulnerable to tidal floods, saltwater intrusion, and water shortages. The government said the decline in groundwater levels in the northern coast of Java is 1 to 25 centimeters per year, while the rise in sea levels is 1 to 15 centimeters per year which causes tidal floods of around 5 to 200 centimeters. The seawall project also aims to address the water supply problem in Jakarta, which relies on groundwater extraction. The wall would include within it a freshwater reservoir to store rainwater and river water and provide clean water for the city. Defense Minister Prabowo Subianto said the project's hefty cost of between $50 billion and $60 billion was a necessary expense to address geological concerns on Java's north coast. Some experts on Wednesday suggested more environmentally friendly alternatives to reduce tidal floods. The idea of building a gigantic seawall in Jakarta was first proposed in 2010, but it faced opposition from some environmental groups and local politicians, who argued that it would disrupt many livelihoods and damage the marine ecosystem. It could narrow and close the fishing catch area, threatening the livelihoods of many who depend on the sea for their food and income. So guys, our journey ends here, is this giant seawall saves Jakarta? Please comment below about this wall and subscribe Talktiv for more mega construction projects all around the world. Thanks for joining us.